all right guys so elon musk is probably one of the greatest people of our time and we're about to check him out uh, uh, check him out right now elon musk criticizing donald trump i've always loved elon musk he's always been pretty dear to my heart as a person so let's go ahead and get right into it this administration you had argued pretty vociferously that it was best to engage and better to be in the room than not be in the room uh, then when the president decided to pull out of paris you said that was kind of the last straw you were going to drop off what drove you to that and if you were still speaking to him today what would you say to the president well i, I thought it was worth uh doing you know, trying hard to um you know to, to do what's worth it was worth trying i got a lot of flack from, from multiple fronts for even trying um when some, some guy ran at billboards and like uh attacking me and like full page ads in the New York Times and whatnot um, just for just for being on the panel um, and and you know in every in every meeting I was like just trying to make the arguments um, in favor of sustainability um, and uh, you know, sometimes other issues like we need to make sure that our immigration laws are not unkind or unreasonable um, and uh, you know did my best, and I, I think in a few cases I did actually make some progress, which gave me uh, some encouragement to continue. Um, but, but then I just really think that the Paris Accord, man, I, I'm, I'm, if I stayed on the councils, then I'd be essentially saying that that wasn't important, but it was super important um, because I think the country needs to keep its word. Um, and, you know, that, that's. It's, it's not, not even a binding, binding agreement. agreement. So, so we, we always like slow it down. Um, the, the, the argument, argument that there would be job losses, losses well, we could, we could see if there are job losses, losses before we exit the agreement. And maybe, maybe there won't be job losses, maybe there will be job gains. Um, but yeah, there's just no way I could stay on after that. <laughs> so, you know, did my best. <laughs> he said he did his best. Um, and it's only it makes sense you know trump I, he's a smart guy this is let's put all race and all that shit to the side donald trump is a smart guy you don't become the president of the united states being dumb you know um but i feel like some of the, the decisions he's making overall for the entire country just doesn't work it just doesn't work that's my opinion um, some of it may work, some of it may not. I feel like he's good with the finance stuff. If anything, I would trust him to fix our financial situation, our debt situation, more than anyone, any other president ever, because he's good with finance. But in terms of, like, ethic issues, I feel like he's not made for that, you know, like, building a wall, all that shit. I feel like, in my opinion, I feel like he's not good as an ethical president, if that makes sense. Like, in terms of how he thinks about people maybe he's not good at that i'm not saying he's a bad person maybe it's just not for him maybe he should just stick to the financial side and maybe have his administration kind of advise to him what to do overall about ethic issues but ethic relations is completely different and like i said i may not know what i'm always talking about i don't know i'm just saying in my opinion don't get fucking pissed trump fans okay anyways to all the Elon Musk fans, thanks. Make sure you subscribe because I'm probably going to make more videos on this guy. And peace.